Welcome to Consolidated Sterilizer Systems instructional video series. My name is Dave Hartung. In this video, I'll be showing you how to change the paper roll to the Advantage PB Impact Printer. To begin, press the button on the left side of the printer and swing out the paper assembly. Press the retaining clips together and remove the washer that holds the paper roll in place. Press the retaining clips together again and pull the paper roll out of the printer. Cut the paper roll from the rest of the paper. Next, press the feed button to remove any excess paper still in the printer. To load the new roll, place it in the printer so that the paper is coming over the top of the roll as shown. Next, reinstall the black washer to the retaining clips, making sure that the indent is facing in. Feed the end of the paper into the bottom of the printer as shown, and then press the feed button to take up any extra slack. Next, close the printer door and make sure to tear off any extra printer paper from the printer. At this point, turn the controller off by using the power switch. Press the feed button and hold it while you turn the controller power back on. Once you've turned the power back on, release the feed button. Now, a test print should be produced. If the test print is produced, then you've loaded the printer paper correctly. Remember, how often you have to replace the printer roll is dependent on settings you define, such as print intervals and cycle times, as well as the number of cycles run per day. We recommend having anywhere from five to 10 paper rolls on hand at any time. You can order extra paper rolls from your local CSS authorized parts distributor. Thanks for watching this video on how to change the printer roll on your Advantage PB Controller Impact Printer. Please visit us on the web for more information at www.consterile.com.